Okay, so what do we know so far? We know that we had a mysterious package to deliver to Falk. And we know that we got shot but survived and the wound healed. Aside from that, we only know Nils here. <laughs> so, in actuality, we don't know a whole lot. But I imagine things are about to get pretty crazy. Like, look at this. These people just got decimated. There's no chance. So where do we trails. find Falk? The Illyrium lab is just ahead. What's Illyrium? I don't think you're cleared for that. I don't think it matters anymore. Right. Well, we found it a couple years ago. Didn't take long to figure out that it's an extraterrestrial element. Some sort of space rock. Can't be a coincidence that these outsiders attacked the only Illyrium lab on Earth. It's gonna be interesting to see how all of the XCOM technologies get introduced. Director Frost, it is with all due respect for you and the organization you represent that I compose this note imploring you to please rein in the actions of one Agent Angela Weaver currently in your employ. The audacity of Agent Weaver's actions of late can only be motivated by perplexing and utterly unfounded paranoia, General Deems. I think that is the, uh, the lady that we met at the very beginning Damn. turned into some type of molten rock. <laughs> I don't really need the pistol. I'd rather keep something for up close and something for a little distance. I think a little versatility is going to go a long way. What does it mean? It's a good question. Lyrium 115 quantum energy weapon. This make any sense to you? Are you kidding? I'm no scientist. But I've talked to them. They think this stuff is Elvis and the Second Coming rolled into one. Makes sense. In the future, Illyria becomes quite a powerful resource. A bunch of formulas again. Oh, we got a couple of individuals here. We're not the only ones alive. You there, stop! Stand down, soldier. Oh, fuck. Agent Nils, good to see you alive. Agent Carter, we need to talk. That's right, William Carter, Agent Second Class CIA, reporting as ordered. Now, can I get some answers? You had an artifact to deliver. Do you have it? Yeah. That's not really around anymore. It was destroyed in the fighting, sir. I'd be dead if it hadn't somehow healed my wounds. Interesting. When we get out of here, my team will want to do some tests. Sir, with respect, my assignment here is temporary. Under the circumstances, I should report immediately to Director Frost. We have to assume that the Director of Central Intelligence is dead. Sorry, Carter, but the protocols are clear. You work for me now. What? I can't just be here. Uncertain. There's been a nationwide communications blackout. I'm working under the assumption that Washington has been hit. My god. For now, we have to assume the worst. Do we know anything about these things? We've theorized about these outsiders for some time, but this is our first confirmed contact. And it's gone just great. We were hoping to learn more from that artifact you lost. But now, we've got no shortage of material to study. I just want to know one thing. How to get rid of them. You and me both, Carter. We want to learn more from the artifact you lost. Like that, like that could have been prevented. Why did they attack us? We've got a lot of theories, but no answers. Maybe they're from the moon, and they don't want us coming there first. <laughs> this is hardly the time for jokes, Agent Carter. We can't stay here. First, we evacuate this facility. Then, we'll figure out how to strike back. Getting out of here is gonna be tough. I've got to finish securing the research here. Without it, we won't have a chance. 
You, Nils, and Agent Kinney, collect the commanders in the war room and lead them to the rail platform. Understood. Okay, I got another crew member. This is good. Agent Carter, good to meet you. Save it until we're out of here, Agent. Kinney, what happened to Agent Weaver? She headed towards the war room a little while ago. No word if she made it. She'll turn up. She always does. Okay, so that's obviously not the the girl that we met at the very beginning then. Down there, in the lab. What are they doing? Oh. Don't know, don't care. Get into position while they're distracted. Imagine this is going to be blocked off. Yeah. Oh, but who needs ammo? <clears throat> okay. They I'm going to see us yet. Try to get these guys into a decent spot. Which is not going to be easy. Let's see. I'm going to put him into full cover. If I can. Move! Moving to position. Let's take out one of these big guys. Sectoid, yeah. Take outside, him down. Sure. That's your target. Switch over to Kinney. It's mine. Open fire! Yeah, Take see, things there. just slow Run down, away. right? They don't... They don't, um, stop completely. I'm gonna scatter Force this. Them out. It's interesting, because I really don't know what a lot of this stuff does just yet. And then I'm gonna put down a turret. Set up a gun! Oh, that turret's huge! Okay, let's get you moving here, Kinney. You're going in. Try to flank these guys. Cover there! On my way! Attack! Actually, you know what? Let's move him. Going now. I'll try to provide some cover fire. Oh, he gets up there. They're dead. Let's move. Nice. That's it. Let's move on. I see why Falk wants you for the bureau, Carter. That's what I told him. Now, at this point, I don't think we know what the Bureau is, exactly. What did a lot it of look criticisms. like upstairs, Nils? Bad. We lost the base. The boys are in full retreat. Do you think anyone made it out? I doubt it. There's been a lot of criticisms about uh, some of the combat. I'll carry that thought on in a second here. To Private Lance, William Carter is not to leave quarters unless in the custody of Lieutenant Garber Paul. Photographic identification of both Garber Paul and William Carter are included with this correspondence. These orders are of highest priority. Under no circumstances, anyone other than the courier himself to manipulate, manhandle, or in any way come into physical contact with the case trusted to his charge. I have to wonder if... They didn't assign me the case knowing that something was odd with me. There's something going on. Uh, but some of the criticisms of this game include the, uh, include the combat. People say it's too much first-person shooter. What did this? Let's not find out. Just get to the war room, collect the brass, and get out. 
if any of them are left to collect. But I look at it as it's only as first person shooter as you make it. Like if I wanted to, I could have just stood there and shot at all the aliens, but you know, choosing to use your guys to flank and eventually when we learn how to use different abilities and things like that. I'm hoping uh, that it becomes really strategic and that's the way I'm going to approach it. I'm getting I'm guessing what's going to happen here is I'm going to lose these guys somehow. Engaging. More artillery. Whoa. We shouldn't feel it this far underground. Here they come. Okay, what do we have here? Now, we don't have a lot of great positions for these guys. Get behind that! Cover me, Carter! Hit it hard! Focus on that one! Get a beat! And we're gonna move Kinney up. I'm on my way! And let's get that turret out there again. Put up a turret! Take it out! Probably overkill for two down? aliens here, but... Deploy the turret! I've got this, you feel that? Come on. Here we go. That's the last one! Come on back, gentlemen. Got it, regrouping. <laughs> Ready. I love the music. <laughs> so good. Check under the stairs as usual. Head out. Yeah, heading there. Ready. All right. If I need to, I'm going to try to get up close here. Where are these guys? Let's stay together here. All right, on my way. Set up over there. You got it. Get oh, you position. can issue like quick yeah, yeah, commands. Got it. Regrouping. Okay. What were they doing with the Illyrium down here? Everything. Reactors, munitions, all kinds of stuff. Some of the things I saw, it was just like out of one of the old Captain Thunderclap serials. <laughs> Kind of spooky in a way. Oh shit. What do we have here? Illyrium reactors. You better believe it. A reactor like this must put out as much juice as the Hoover Dam. I don't have a clue what I'm looking at. Jesus, those walls were supposed to withstand a nuclear blast. Let's get out before the whole place comes down. Toast. Oops. Come on now. I'm gonna try to take this turret out before I go and revive them. I'm pinned down! Let's go, Med Spray! 
Okay, just start shooting. Take it down! Opening fire! Yeah, my vitals are not great right now. Damn. Hold on, man. Oh, nice. He got him up. Watch yourself out there. Help, Carter. Get behind that. Hurry. I'm here. Okay. Attack. Taking aim. That's your target. Taking it down! Pin down! Let's see how that works. Uh oh, a little bounce back. I'm shot to pieces here. That'll do. Trouble here. Need orders. That's it. Let's keep moving. Making bombs with the Illyrium. What were they yeah. building down here? Nuclear bombs. Bigger than any nuke we have now. Way bigger. Weapons fabrication. <laughs> no end to the things Illyrium could do there. Anything we can use? Not unless you want to carry a bomb. Haha. <laughs> Alright, I'll pass, thanks. One thing I may try out is uh, using a controller because I've seen the way the controllers work with the radial menu and I think that may be a little bit easier to command. The war room is this way. As much as I appreciate the, the better accuracy with the mouse and keyboard, but I just think that radial menu will be easier for issued orders. Whoa! Well, things aren't going as planned down here. Why? What are they doing? This place is coming down. We gotta get the hell out of here. First we save the brass, then we evac. The war room is just ahead. Keep firing! He's almost dead! Excuse me, boys. Come on, gents, take a wall. What happened in here? Nothing good. Move. Open fire! General Deems, Director Falk, has been nothing less than cagey as regards the finding of his team at the operation of Montana. The director has flat out ignored requests to deliver the apparatus uncovered in the Bannock Mines. I'm guessing that's what I was carrying, uh, to our laboratories here at Fort Groom. He claims to have secured an, the artifact at an undisclosed facility, the whereabouts of which are so highly classified that I can't even verify the place even exists. Falk is protected all the way up the chain, well beyond my pay grade. I've informed him repeatedly that the request to transfer the object comes down from you, but he still refuses to acquiesce. I've done all I can, sir. So, in a world of government cover-ups, aliens is like worst case scenario. And I think that they know they know more than they're letting on. General Deems, are you alright, sir? Where's Fog? What happened here? I'll ask the question, son. Yes, sir. Director Falk is at the rail platform. Our orders are to escort you there immediately. Then lead the way. Whoa! Ah! General! Clear the target, now! Oh, that's Weaver. That's not Deems! He's one of them! Nils, get back! Just hang on, sir. It's gonna be... Uh-oh. Okay! Uh, 
Why did you stop me? What the hell were you thinking? I was thinking that I just saved your life. Who are you? What the hell are you doing in the war room? Senior Agent Angela Weaver, from the Bureau. The Director sent me here to guard the brass. Then what went wrong? Deems was already under outsider control when I got here. Some of them put up a fight, but not for long. One of their puppets attacked me earlier. What's causing this? I'm not sure, but obviously it's connected to this attack. We've been tracking cases like this for years. Deems was one of our top brass. How did he come under their control without anybody realizing? As far as we know, there's no way of telling who might be susceptible to their control. If they got to Deems, they could get to any of us. You knew that he killed Hoover and the others. You could have taken him out earlier. I was going to, but he was resisting their control. He might have been able to fight it off. I shot him to stop him from killing the three of you. It's interesting because uh, there's no female uh, operatives in the Bureau, but the Bureau is advanced enough to have some high-ranking officials that are females. I think that's kind of cool. We have to get out of here. Falk ordered us to bring any survivors to the rail platform. The Diesel will only get you as far as the test site. Can we radio for evac from there? We're nearly out of time. Get to the rail platform and head out to the test site. I'll call in a Sky Ranger, collect Falk, and meet you there. If you can't reach the test site, we'll have no choice but to leave without you. General right. Deems. I can't believe this. All of them. Dead. Who's in command now? Falk is. And until we hear otherwise, we assume that he's in charge. For all we know, he's the president. You really think they got Kennedy? Let's go. Now!